Uh, hey everyone, uh, this is Umakan. Welcome all of you to my YouTube channel. So this is the video for the GATE Physics 2022 question analysis. So today was the examination for GATE uh, Physics. So hope you have did uh, well in examination. So I have some memory based question with me. So I will discuss it in my video. So hope you will enjoy and uh, uh, will get your interest and keep your interest uh, till the end of this video. So let's start the session and have a discussion. So I have uh, some of the question from aptitude section. So this question is from aptitude session for two marks so there is a question like if e is investing three thousand per month for six months and q is investing x amount of money for eight months uh, and the uh, profit ratio of uh, q was given four by nine then what will the value of x so this is a very simple question you can try it and then the finally x will be three thousand so correct answer for this question was uh, three thousand and uh, the question was based on english grammar so uh, there is short passage was there so after uh, reading this, the which of the uh, option is correct? The question was like that. So I think this option will be correct. Like you can take food any time, but uh, not earlier than than something like there there. Okay. So I think this option will be correct. Then there is a question of uh, number of step required to move from P two to P five. Like so, this answer may be seven. Okay. So uh, next question was very interesting. So they given a. a Thing like p by q is like 1 by 2 q by r is uh, 3 by 4 something like that and uh, and they mentioned that uh, u was 50 percent more like uh, more than the p so what will be uh, ratio of p by u so correct answer will be 16 by 45 so it was in the option d i think uh, then blood relation question was there so one blood relation question was there so the final answer may be uh, uncle i think uncle will be the correct answer but some students are still wondering about brother so let's have a way to the final key but uncle will be most probably the correct answer and no and no was the question uh, uh, answer was there so no and no will be the correct answer to the final question so these are some of the questions from aptitude session so let's have the uh, discussion on the physics session so this question was from quantum mechanics and harmonic oscillator so the question was uh, asked uh, which is the matrix form of this operator x which is represented by h by 2m omega root over a dagger plus f so this will be the correct answer like 0 1 0 1 0 root 2 0 root 2 0 okay so this this question was for two marks and the mcq section question was there uh, this is a very uh, nice question uh, this question was uh, from particle in a box and uh, there is a linear combination of wave function uh, like this and uh, you have to find the probability of finding particle in the first exercise step so first of all you have to take uh, it in the form of 2 by l root over sine n pi x by 2a this is important because length of the box was 2a so after uh, make uh, the wave function in this form then you have to normalize one second the normalization constant will be root 2 and then you have to multiply the probability of finding the particle in the first exercise tested was 33 percent but answer will become like uh, 0.33 but the answer was uh, required in term of percentage so it will be 33 percentage so 33 percentage will be 33 will be a correct answer to the question so this question was also for uh two marks this question was also for two marks uh next uh, this question is from quantum mechanics also so which of the option is the hermitian operator so one by i d by ds will be the hermitian operator because if you take the dagger of this operator then it will be minus one by i minus of d by ds so once again it will be in the form of one by i uh, d by ds so this will be the hermitian operator uh, then uh, it it was a very nice question also. There was a quantum spherical uh, sphere cell set. So which of the uh, options are correct? So first of all, this will be the ground state energy h square square pi square by two r square. The radius was r. And then this will be the uh, Schrodinger equation for the uh, system because it will be h square minus h square square by two m. 1 by r square d by dr of r square dr over e naught of r where e 0 is the energy and the wave function will be in the sine form so these three option will be correct and this question was for two marks okay so the next question is from solid state question uh, solid state physics i have discussed it several times in my channel so the question was the uh, was given like a linear relationship between omega and k so s will be 1 because power of k is 1 i mean dimension was 2d so d equal to 2 so density of state will be proportional to e to the power d by s minus 1 so if finally you will get density of state is proportional to e and e is equal to h square to omega so energy density of state will be proportional to omega 
so this question was also for two marks okay so i have several time discussed such type of question in my short trick video so this is a very nice question uh, then uh, this is a very interesting question from langrajan so langrajan of harmonic of two dimensional isotopic harmonic oscillator was like that and uh, for conserving of this quantity that is x dot y dot plus alpha x y so what will be alpha then take the time derivative of this constant quantity and make it zero uh, find the hamiltonian from this langrajan uh, find px py x dot y dot x double dot y dot double dot then put it and make it zero so you will get alpha equal to k by s and you can solve it from the commutation also uh, then one of the question was there uh, from atomic molecular physics so hamiltonian was given like that k is equal to gos l dot s and alpha was here so what will the value of l alpha for 2p 1 by 2 and 2p 3 by 2 so if you uh, use the formula j equal to l plus s and make the whole square of the both the side then you can determine l dot s and if for the value of j equal to 1 by 2 here and for j value of 3 by 2 then uh, you have subtract the both the value then you will get alpha is equal to 3 so alpha is equal to 3 will be the correct answer for this question and this question also for 2 marks okay uh, then this is a ls coupling term question so the question was 4 is 2 3p2 3d1 this is very uh, easy actually so what will the term symbol term symbol will you carry in term of e d and s so this is the correct answer to the question uh, then a beta decay question was there i think option uh, still not confirmed but uh, third transition uh, one option is there plus to plus so it will be allowed beta decay and one is there uh, like first forbidden second forbidden and four to zero was third forbidden so it was a matching question okay you have to match so this question was also for one mark this question was also for one mark uh, then this is a quantum mechanical question uh, perturbation so you have you can calculate here okay and uh, you can use the short trick also here so it uh, this uh, system having more energy than this system and than this system so it will be greater than e1 and greater than e3 this question was for two marks uh, then uh, there is a metal semiconductor junction uh, like uh, as you know ms junction so if a metal and semiconductor junction is here the potential band, band diagram will be like this and iv variation will be in the reverse way it will be very close to straight line so two options was there one like yes na? like and one was like very close so this option will be correct so i think this option will be the correct answer if this is correct then it will be uh, that is the question was considered for two marks okay and uh, a thermodynamic question was there it's very easy so internal energy u will be minus t square d, uh, d of f by t of dt so this option was correct answer uh, this question i think for one marks this question uh, was for one marks okay uh, then uh, it is a question from bjt bjt so uh, you know emitter current is always greater than ic so collector current is always less than emitter current this statement was correct it was msq okay and uh, you know gain factor beta is proportional to always dependent upon temperature and uh, you know emitter emitter is a highly doped because it provides the charge carrier so this three option will be correct this question was for one marks okay and there is a question from polymatrix uh, this property will be correct that is sigma alpha sigma beta minus sigma beta sigma alpha equal to Two of Kornecker, uh, two of Lebesgue beta plus sigma gamma, and uh, sigma alpha sigma beta plus sigma beta sigma alpha. It will be two of Kornecker alpha beta. So this question was in MSQ question section, and it was for one mark. Okay. So these are some of the question I have collected. So thank you so much. Uh, if I got more question, then I will upload. So hope you enjoyed the section and have a idea, and you can. Uh, you can check your answer you have part you have performed in the examination thank you so much for watching my video thank you so much